Hello, this is Thursday, it is not Tuesday. We have stopped the Tuesday Christmas unboxings, but since it's near Christmas, and since the club card price is getting good on gift packs, decided the next couple of Thursday reviews, weekly reviews, are going to be a couple of good gift packs, which you've seen on Instagram, if you've been following us on Instagram. So today I'm looking forward to this, because I've, I've tried this a long time ago, this beer, just in general, but I always hear good things about it. And um, yeah, it looks quite decent. You've got a uh, Bira Moretti there, hopefully I've said that right. And the glass looks quite good. It's got like, um, kind of been dented a bit. And this was, it's about seven odd quid, when it, well, club card price, I think. <laughs> I remember how much the other gift pack was <laughs> through the magic of knowing. So I'm gonna open this. The one thing I will say, and I'll probably say this in uh, a future video for the other gift pack as well. Oh, that's a nice picture on the back. Is if you're gonna have a gift pack, especially of something like beer, that's not a spirit. That's nice. That's a pint as well. That looks like a shuna glass. That is a pint glass. That is nice. I'm very happy with that. Because as, as we know, it's probably gonna go a shirt one day. Uh, my wife will kill me because I have too many beer glasses. But that is really nice. I don't know if the camera can pick it up there. I like the logo. That's I don't know if that's going to wear away too much over time with washing up and things. But that that's a pint. So that's nice. And it's up high like that. It's got traditional quality. Qualita. Qualita e traditional. Written on the bottom there. And then it's got the year. I'm going to go and quickly wash that out. But through the magic of camera editing. You're not going to see a goddamn thing. Again, I have tested this and it seemed right when I was testing it, but if this microphone is giving off some weird static feedback, I've got another one on order. It did it when we we're doing the Advent Calendar Day 3 video. So by the time this goes out, it might be fixed with the new microphone. I'm sorry if I keep flicking over there. Because I'm sitting on this side of the camera, I've got the microphone plugged in <laughs> to this side, which usually is on that side, which is the opposite side to where the camera lens is. But let's get back to what we're talking about. This is the Bira Moretti box set. You've got two bottles here, got a pint glass. The irony of it is, if I can get these out, Jesus, they're in good. The irony of it is, these are only 330ml bottles and would fit in a Schooner glass. And then you go, but you can fill that with two bottles, which you probably can. There's going to be more than a pint there because a Schooner glass is two thirds pint. So we've got two two third pint bottles, mouth uh, tongue twister there, say that two times fast and a pint glass. But the one thing I will say, and I might say about any gift sets or unboxings I'll do in the future for bottled beer, as opposed to a spirit, we've got a beer here. It's a no brainer, just put a little cheap bottle opener in there. <laughs> Open that on Christmas day, where's the bottle opener? I've got to go and find it. It's not in the comfort of the gift pack. But I like the way it's presented. It's just cardboard, but it's, it's nicely done, nice design on it. So let's, uh, the ACDC which came from Matlock Bath. Um, yeah, so I decided to do some more gift packs because the price was right. So I've just washed this out, pour that out. Now, it's been a long time since I've tried this. People tell me about it. Whoa, that rises quick. A lot of head on that, it rises quick. Um, let's see if it goes down as quick. While I'm waiting for the head to go down, obviously the way I pour beer is to get all that um, carbon dioxide out so it's not bloaty when it's inside you because you can pour it against the side of the glass not get much of a head on it it looks great and people go oh look i'm pouring a beer but you do that you're going to get bloated and also the moment you eat any carbs they're going to bubble it up in your stomach so you want to get rid of that now but um yeah there's different beers do different stuff that head went up real quick it's quite white almost artificial looking in a way quite a light beer there um, I don't, I think it's just standard beer, isn't it? I don't think it's, uh, not going to say anything on the box, is it? Premium lager, it's just a lager. It's got a pale ale, uh, quality to it, but also nice pour on that. What does it smell like? I feel a bit cheap now, because I forgot that this was a lager, and I feel like <laughs> reviewing a lager on this channel is a bit, well, not beneath me, but lager isn't proper beer, and the few people that are fans of what I'm doing here won't want me drinking a lager. Well, I think they'll, uh, that forgive me, along with uh, Luigi Moretti. When uh, I try this beer, let's give it a go. Two things happened then. First one, 
there's a sort of citrus taste to the head on it before I get that flavor coming from the bubbles there before I got to the lager itself a sort of a light citrusiness to it and you get to it and that is a premium lager I've not reviewed many lagers but that is premium lager. there's a, a solid taste to it nothing too fancy it's almost heavy it's got a wall of fizz that's light but it hits you at a certain point within the taste It goes down a treat. What's the percentage on that? 4.6, not bad. Not bad at all. Um, as we're looking at the box set, salute to life's simple pleasures. I have to say, that is quite a nice little box set. I think it was about £7, £7.50, something thereabouts. Um, this and Peroni, I hear a lot about people going, they're the upper echelon of beer in a pub lager. I think Peroni's lager as well. I don't really drink the usual suspects if you see what I mean but we have to get Peroni on at some point let's we'll see if it's better than that but that wasn't too bad the glass is the glass was worth the price alone so the beer is a nice extra but as I say the glass was worth the price alone and next Thursday I'm going to give you a sneak peek if you've not been on my Instagram I bought this for someone as a gift and then I saw they had more in Tesco they sold out then they got more and I thought I'll give that a whirl because for the price, this was £8.50 on club car price, £10 on normal. It is Lefe. Now, I've tried Ho Garden, and I think this is a very similar thing. There's two Lefe Brune, two Lefe Blonde, and one iconic glass. And I cannot wait to open that. And that is what I'm reviewing next Thursday. Um, hopefully, the person I've bought one of these for is not watching the video. I appreciate you watching. We've been doing the advent calendar every day. I've been opening that god awful LA Dodgers advent calendar, which has nothing to do with LA Dodgers, which I got cheap, so I'm not too fussed with that. And my wife Stacy is reviewing the Pucker Tea advent calendar. Hopefully, our microphone issues are getting better. And if you tune into that, that'd be great. Like the videos as always, if you want. Dislike them if you want. Subscribe if you want to come and hang out and watch the videos. That's fine. If you don't, that's also quite fine. And this beer, speaking of fine, it's quite fine. If you can find this box set, or just this glass, I highly recommend it. It's a nice, that is a nice glass. That's a pint. That is, I like the Sheena glasses, but to get a pint one, and with a picture that bold, while it's brand new, isn't too bad. So I just want to say cheers, and uh, Merry Christmas if you don't tune into the Lefe episode, but I'm really looking forward to that. And uh, I appreciate you watching this year. We're putting, putting a lot of content out. Travel vlogs. I think there's one coming out on a Saturday soon, maybe in a couple of days' time. We've not been doing too many because we're in the advent calendar every day. But I appreciate you watching. And also, <laughs> just fit this in. You've come to see the beer. We are be going to be doing a year in review somewhere right near the end of the year, just picking out our best bits from our travels this year. So, cheers. <laughs>